What's up guys, take a look at Kageura, a new world champion, which means two Japanese world champions at the world championships. So the second round against the American, pretty easy for Kageura. The American tried a couple of techniques and then Kageura just turned it over into that Nawaza that he likes so much. So here we see the, the failed attempt. And then Kageura locking up underneath, cross grip, under the gi, using his head as leverage rolling him over and to be honest the American just kind of gave up he was like oh shit I'm done so that was uh, round two for Kageura but then things got a little bit more difficult a little bit more uh, challenging and it's definitely in the next two fights that were probably the most difficult obviously the final as well but uh, the semi-final was kind of a strange one if you ask me against Silva from Brazil. So looking for an Uchimata here, Kayura. Never really seen him do Uchimata before, but he definitely has the flexibility with his Uchimata Skashi. And uh, there were a couple of interesting uh, Nawaza exchanges where uh, Kayura just explodes and gets out of some dangerous situations. So showing real awareness. I do think the rest of the Japanese team, except Maruyama, they were just a bit unaware of the different rule set. Maybe they're too used to the rules in Japan. It is a little bit different. They do score things a bit differently. And uh, Kageura, on the other hand, he he's well studied. He he knows the game very well. Look, elbow out here, and he knows that's not a score. So here's the exchange here where it goes to the ground and Kagura showing that he doesn't just have Osai Komi, he's got a nice little armbar as well and it's good to see a heavyweight rollover like that transition the leg. Very very good armbar by Kagura. Right this next fight against the Finnish judoka, this was a real difficult one for Kagura, probably the most difficult one for him. Both of them, Seoinage specialists and Pumalayanamun, I can't pronounce his name. Uh, he had a beautiful standing Ippon Seoinage early on in the day. But just a big strong guy and he had a good uh, tactical approach to Kageura. But as time went on, uh, he got more tired and Kageura's stamina, I think won him the fight. I mean look at this, how, how often do you see heavyweights? Uh, throwing together combinations like that. Good defense here. Almost gets thrown. And here's this escape. He just didn't like the Newaza and he's out quickly. I guess when you're a smaller judoka and you're facing the heavyweights, you really have to explode like that. Make sure you're safe at all times. Seoinage attempt and then goes for that... Uh, roll over into also Komi that he likes but uh, the Finnish judoka he saw it coming definitely doing his homework nice seoi nage attempt here popping the shoulder out love to see that dropping down and then it doesn't look like a score but uh, I've got another angle for you guys and to be honest I'm sure there'll be some disagreements about this one is it a wazari or is it not? Mm, that's a close one. That's a close one. But they give it to him. So Kagura is a wazari up, but uh, he decides not to run away. Uh, beautiful uh, Kochi there. Ippon and into the semi final now. And this is against Silva from Brazil, who is a giant. And Kageura, he was like, okay, I'm going to grip. I'm going to do some foot sweeps. Counter. And play the Shido game because uh, this match was boring. Boring as hell. Okay. Anyway, moving on. We're into the finals now against Bashaev from Russia. Oh, whoops. The Russian Judo Federation. Sorry. Uh, the Russians. Those guys are... Uh, doping, but the Russian Judo Federation is not, just to let you guys know. 
So for some reason, Kaguda thought uh, Tomoinage would be a good uh, weapon in this fight. But uh, in hindsight, he might have just been setting up his Seoinage because he has uh, two attempts at the Tomoinage. Here's another one. He tries to cut the corner this time, rotating him around. No go. But then that sets up a Seoinage later on. And Bashayev looking to lock up that arm. But Kagura, great defense. Almost gets the pin himself, to be honest. And Bashayev's so strong. I wonder why. No, I'm just joking, guys. I'm just joking. I'm sure the Russian team has never done steroids or doped ever in their life. So this is the score. Opposite side. And that's definitely a score, unlike uh, earlier on in the quarterfinals. And then Kagura does well to defend. Almost gets thrown here. And then almost gets put into the Nemoza. Rolls over. And then he's got really good uh, escapes from Nemoza. Look at this. Beautiful escape. And that's... Uh, that's a pretty good way to end the match, I reckon. So close. And a new world champion from Japan. Alright guys, uh, like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys uh, for the team events. Peace.